This is the video for lesson 7 on my website, The Commutative Property of Addition. This is a very quick lesson, but an important one. We know that when we add, it doesn't matter what order we add our two numbers in. So for example, we know that 2 plus 5 is the exact same thing as 5 plus 2. We're just combining numbers. The order doesn't matter. Now if we wanted to be fancy and use symbols, we could say that a plus b equals b plus a. Again, it doesn't matter what order we add the two numbers in. We have a special name for that property. We call it the commutative property of addition. Make sure that you memorize that name. You'll hear it again and again. And sometimes a test question is, des is designed to see if you simply know that name. They'll show you something like this and say, what property is this demonstrating? It's called the commutative property of addition. The order in which we add two numbers doesn't matter. Now, think about subtraction for a moment. If you think about subtraction, you'll notice that this property does not apply to subtraction. 5 minus 2 is not the same thing as 2 minus 5. In subtraction, we're not allowed to just simply reverse the order of our two numbers. It would give us a different answer. Again, this is just a very basic lesson. Memorize the name commutative property. In upcoming lessons, we'll learn what other operations are commutative and which ones aren't.